What's up everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to talk to you about how to deal with small thumbnail sizes on your website. Now, there's a couple of things you could do. I'm going to use this website over here. It's one of my many websites. And I'm going to show you a section that has thumbnails that are smaller than what the theme requires. So you see this thumbnail over here and you see this one over here. They're not taking up the full space as the theme wants it to. So what can you do? Well, you might be thinking that you'll go into your dashboard and maybe you watched one of my previous videos on how to regenerate thumbnails using the Regenerate Thumbnails plugin. So you go to Tools, Regenerate Thumbnails, click the button right there. And once it's done processing, you think it should be corrected, right? So you go back to the front of the website, scroll down, and you see it didn't adjust the size because that's not what Regenerate Thumbnails is supposed to do. What it does is, it takes the image and refactors it based on the size dimensions that the theme is requesting. But if the image is smaller than the size being called in, then regenerate thumbnails is not going to take care of that for you. But there's another solution. So what I'm going to do is I'll go back to the dashboard. We're going to add a plugin. Go over here to the search plugins section. And we're going to look for this plugin right here called Thumbnail Upscale. You can check out some more information over here. It says it hasn't been tested with the current version of WordPress, but it does work. And I'll demonstrate that now. So we'll install this plugin. We'll activate it. And once you activate it, then we could use our Regenerate Thumbnails plugin. And once that's done, let's go back to the front of the website. And we see that it adjusted the images. Now, if it's a very small image, then it's going to be very pixelated and distorted. So in that case, probably the best solution would be to recreate that image if possible, and then upload it and replace it as the featured image for that particular post or page. But if you have a bunch of blog posts and pages that have a lot of small images that are just a little bit smaller than the sizes that the theme you're using requires, then using the thumbnail upscale plugin is a great alternative to having to manually swap out all of the images being used on your website. And again, the smaller icons, the smaller images are not going to be that great because of the pixelation issue. All right, so that's a very easy way, you know, to deal with the issue of images that are a little bit smaller than what the theme is requesting to be used for display. Again, we're using the Thumbnail Upscale plugin, and we're using it in conjunction with the Regenerate Thumbnails plugin as well. All right, hopefully you found this video helpful. I just wanted to show you a quick way to deal with the issue of smaller images being displayed on your website. If you found the video helpful, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification icon down below, so that way you'll get notified whenever I release a new video. And if you need help with your website, visit pixelweb.com. Contact me so we can get started on building your website. All right, again, don't forget, thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Take care.